Good morning children. Today I am here with a new chapter Chotu's house from class 3 NCRT looking around. Chotu came to Mumbai for the first time. So we have series of pictures. In the first picture we see that Chotu came to Mumbai for the first time. In the second picture we see that uh, Chotu is getting wet in the rain and feel unprotected. In the third picture, we see that Chotu has taken shelter inside a pipe. In the other picture, we see that uh, it seems like that uh, Chotu made pipe his home. Now, next picture we can see and another boy like Chotu has also came to Mumbai and he is searching for a shelter. Now we can uh, see in the picture that they are become a good friends and they are starting living together. Now children you can see here are uh, some sets of questions. So we will do these questions. So question first. What did Chotu think when he looked at the pie? So children, Chotu thought he can take shelter in the pie as it would save him from the dust, wind, rain and cold. So I am writing here, Chotu thought. Chotu thought that he can take shelter in the pipe. as it would save him save him from the dust wind cold and rain. So children, this is our first answer. Chotu thought that he can take shelter in the pipe as it would save him from the dust, wind, cold and rain. Now the second question. How did Chotu use the Pipe. So Chotu used the pipe. Chotu used the pipe as a home. In third question, into which parts did Chotu divide the pipe and its surrounding areas? So answer will be, he divided into sleeping area, second one is Cloth drying area, third is cooking area, fourth 
guest sitting area. And five, water storage area. Children, question number four is, in which part of this house will Chotu live to spend most of his time? So, he would spend, he would like to spend like to spend most of his time time in guest sitting area question number 5 why do you think Chotu invited Monu to live with him? So Chotu invited Monu Chotu invited Monu to live with him in the pipe because he saw Monu searching for a Monu Searching for a shelter also Choto would feel Choto would feel if he has Choto will feel better if he has a company at home a company at home now children here are some questions about our own family so question number six is who all live with you in your house so i am writing here mine and you can also write in your notebook accordingly so i live with my mother father sisters brother grandmother Next question, Chotu divided the pipe into different parts. Write the names of the different parts of your house. So I am writing here about my house and different parts of my house. So first one is drawing room. Bedroom. Kitchen, dining, dining room, bathroom,
Next, how much time in a day do you spend in each part of your house? So I spend in drawing room, I spend two hours. In bedroom, I spend eight hours. In kitchen, one hour. Dining room, two hour. Bathroom, half half an hour. Okay, children. Next question: Is there any part of your house where a particular member of your family spends more time? So, my mother spends more time in the kitchen. Next question, is there any part of your house where a particular member never goes or goes for a short time? So my father goes to the kitchen for a very short time. Now children, you must have seen that some animals lives in our houses. These animals lives in our houses because we want them to while some are there is uninvited. So here is a poem. We will see home, sweet home. This is a poem. You always tell me mother, the house belongs to only to us. But how do I believe that mother when I know it belongs to many more? So here is a boy. He is a uh, talking with his mother and said, you always tell me mother, the house belongs only to us. But how do I believe that mother? When I know it belongs to many more. In the second paragraph, look mother, how these mice are all playing catch catch together. And look, how these mosquitoes fly and how peaceful lies the happy spider. Now he is talking about some animals. They are living happily together. So uh, the boy is talking about mice, mosquitoes and spider. In third para, and look mother at the lazy lizard. How slowly it crawls to and fro. And look at so many black ants all marching in a row. Now in this paragraph boy is talking about lazy lizard and so many black ants who all are marching in a row. Now and look outside in the courtyard. The birds are all picking about just like when my sister and I sometimes fight, quarrel and shout. Next para, that is why I say, dear mother, don't think this house is only earth. It's dear to us and all who live here and have been living for many years. So this is the poem which is related to house. Our house as well as animals house. This boy is talking about different types of animals and different types of birds house. So children again we will do some question answers. So question number one again how do you keep your house clean? So children how do you keep your house clean? So by cleaning house with the help of help of broomstick second 
by dusting by dusting the objects kept in our house third by keeping all the all the objects at their respective place next question is who all help to keep your house clean so in my house my mother my mother sister and my brother help to help to clean help to clean our house next question where do you throw through the garbage of your house so we throw it we throw it in the garbage bin in the next question in the any special way in which you decorate your house when and how yes we decorate our house in some of the festival and some occasion like diwali holi and other festival we decorate our house with lights diyas candles flowers etc and the last question is name the things with which you decorate your house so we decorate our house with flowers paintings flower pots caricatures diyas lights and sceneries etc so this was your chapter chotu's house it's all about uh, how people struggle for their shelter there are so many boys and so many girls so many children are there who don't have any place to live in and they are searching for their shelter like chotu he came to mumbai for the first time and he had struggle up so much for their livelihood finally he had decided to live in a pipe and he make a pipe as as a home and he then he uh, he is living with inside a pipe with his friends monu who also came to mumbai for the first time and he was also searching for a shelter so this is all about chotu's house thank you